Now talk about let's talk about uh, three unbiased coins, which is TOS, and we need to find the probability of getting two most heads, most two heads. So most two heads getting a uh, most two heads indicates it can be zero, one, or the max is two. So the logic needs to be applied is like take three coins, the number of sample space for the three coins you need to identify. And you need to identify the events for at most two hits. That's the possibility of events. So the probability is the number of possible events divided by the number of sample space. Now, let's see the sample space is. This is the sample space. It can be tail, 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 three tails, two tail and one head, tail, head, tail, head, two tails, tail, two heads, head, tail, head, two head, tail and three heads. Over here, the at most two heads are this one, which is matching, zero heads, one head, one head, one head, two heads, two heads, two heads, two heads. and we can't in add your three heads because it's it's more than two so the possibility is seven so seven divided by h is the probability now let's see a typical example of putting your balls in a box i got eight red balls followed by seven blue balls and we got six green balls so it is placed in a box and one ball is picked up randomly. What is the probability? That is neither red or nor green. So the number of balls is 21. I need to find a blue ball because it should not be red and green. It should be a blue ball. So you need to identify it, find the event and you need to find the probability. So the total number of balls is 21 and we got 7 blue balls and number of events is 7. So at n by e divided by n by s, 7 by 21 that's 1 by 3. This is the answer.